Hello and welcome to WooCommerce plugin series of Quick Tips. In this series of videos, I will show you all the details about WooCommerce plugin to create e-commerce website. If you are new to my channel, then do subscribe to the channel to get the quick tips on website design, search engine optimization and social media marketing tools. So let's start with the video. So in this video, I'll show you how to add PayPal payment gateway to the WooCommerce website. So right now you can see that I'm on the WordPress website with the WooCommerce installed on it and I'm going to the cart and then I'm going to the checkout. Now here you will see that I do not have any option to make payments and the only option listed here is cash on delivery. So we will need to add payment gateways to the WooCommerce website so that customers will be able to make payments using their credit cards or PayPal or other payment gateways. So we will start with the PayPal payment gateway settings and in the upcoming videos, I'll show you how to add different payment gateways to the WooCommerce website. So let's start with PayPal payment gateway settings. So I'm logged into the WordPress dashboard and we will need to add a new plugin. So go to plugins and then go to add new and in the search box type in WooCommerce PayPal. Now here you will see the option WooCommerce PayPal payments. Click on install now. Now click on activate. All right, so the plugin has been activated. Now let's go to WooCommerce and then go to settings. Now here you will see the option payments, go to payments. Now you will see that right now only one option is activated that is cash on delivery. Now we will need to add online payment gateways. We have added PayPal. So click on setup. All right, now here you will see an option to activate PayPal automatically. You just don't need to find the settings or you can do it manually. You can click on it, toggle to manual credential input. Here you will need to enter the credentials like your PayPal email address, the merchant ID, the client ID and the secret key. So first what we will do, we will do it automatically and after that we will see how to enter the credentials manually. So here click on activate PayPal. Now it will ask you to log into your PayPal account. So if you do not have PayPal account, then you will need to create PayPal account and it must be a business account, not the personal. So enter your PayPal account email address and click next, enter the password. If you already have the PayPal account, then enter the password. Otherwise you will need to create an account. Click on agree and connect. Now click on go back to WooCommerce developers. Now you will see that all the information is filled up automatically. You will see the email address, merchant ID, the client ID and the secret key. Everything is there. So in this way, you don't need to get the credentials manually. Now these are the settings. Right now just click on save changes. Click on enable and click save changes. All right, so the payment gateway has been activated. Now let's check it. Let's go to my website. Right now I'm working on the dummy website. Let's go to the cart. All right, now here you can see that the PayPal payment gateway has been activated on your website. So when you go to proceed to checkout, now here, apart from cash on delivery, you will see PayPal option now. Click on PayPal. So if the customer has PayPal account, they will be able to pay using the PayPal account or if they do not have a PayPal account, they don't need to sign up for the PayPal account. They will be able to pay using their debit card or the credit card. So they can select this option, debit or credit card. And after that, they will enter their credit card information and they can make payments. So this is how you can add PayPal payment gateway to your WooCommerce website. Now let me show you the manual process of entering the credentials here. These are the credentials. If you do not want to go through the automatic process, you can log into your PayPal account. Now here you can click on it and go to account settings. Then go to business information. Now here you will see the merchant ID. You need to enter this merchant ID here. Okay, it's the same one. This is your 
email address for the account login now click on developers now here click on dashboard select live the sandbox option is only for the testing mode so go to live and if you do not have any app click on create app enter the name for the app click create app now here you will see the client ID that uh, you need to enter here and if you click on secret key you will see this key you will need to enter this key here once you fill up the information in these four boxes you will be able to connect your PayPal account with your WooCommerce website so in the next video I'll show you how to add another payment gateway to the WooCommerce website so that's it for now thanks for watching do not forget to subscribe to my channel to get more quick tips about online softwares and tools. If you have any questions, please leave us message in comment section and press the like button if you like the video. Thanks for watching quick tips.